The president of the St. Lucia Bar Association has called on the police and the government to take a proactive approach to fighting crime. His statement follows the Thursday morning shooting incident that left Magistrate Anne Marie Smith nursing injuries to her body. Andy George says the brazen attempt on the life of a member of the judiciary is a clear signal the police need to step up its crime-fighting abilities. Further, it justifies the many calls his association has made for armed protection for members of the legal fraternity. Um, the bar is extremely concerned about the rising level of crime um, involving firearm offenses, of course, on a whole in St. Lucia. But we are particularly concerned that a magistrate would be short um, in this manner in particular. Um, we have often called for proper security to be provided to the judiciary, including the magistrates, but that seemed to fall on their affairs. Um, uh, we, need the, the, we think the government needs to step up in that regard. George was speaking from the Tapio Hospital, where Magistrate Smith is said to be in stable condition. He says, as expected, members of the judiciary are concerned about this latest incident. They are also asking questions of the police and the government. The members of the judiciary, as well as the members of the bar, are extremely disturbed about that incident. Because we have been calling for um, proper facilities at the court. Um, security is lacking. Uh, we have been uh, asking for the system of, of justice to be improved, uh, but all that, uh, again, seems to fall on deaf ears. And, and we are now asking ourselves, who is next? What is going to happen? Um, there really needs to be a proactive approach uh, to, to fighting uh, crime in St. Lucia. I'm afraid that we seem not to take these things seriously. Magistrate Smith serves in the sea court, dealing with criminal and civil matters ranging from rape to drugs and murder. She also presides over court proceedings in Denry. Carmi Joseph, HTS News, Channel 4.